Welcome. Today we will be taking you through the demonstration of Duplicate Invoice Checkbot Solution. In this demo, we will be extracting the information from scanned underlying documents into an readable format. Extracted output will then be used by the bot as input while performing the duplicate check with vendor ledger. As a part of this solution, bot will be executing below steps. Step 1, downloading of underlying documents from an email. Step 2, extraction of fields from the underlying documents into an Excel using OCR. Step 3, downloading of an vendor ledger report from SAP. Step 4, performing the duplicate check on vendor ledger report. Step 5, generating the final report with absolute and potential entries. Before running the bot, let's have a quick check if all the prerequisites are set. As it can be seen, all the folders are empty prior to running the bot. Let us execute the bot now. As we can see at the bottom panel, bot is running. Bot access the IBM notes and download all the documents in the hot folder. The entire downloading process is running in the background. As we can see Bot has successfully downloaded all the underlying documents into an hot folder. These documents will automatically gets processed in OCR tool, Abby Flexi Capture. Let's open Project Setup Station 1 of the component of Abby Flexi Capture to check if all the documents have been successfully imported. As we can see currently the underlying documents are getting processed, Abby Flexi Capture is smart enough to classify and recognize the documents into different categories, for now the underlying documents are the scanned invoices. Let's quickly look over the few of the invoices which have been processed already. As it can be seen, all the values from the invoices has been captured on the left hand side of the panel, on the right hand side we have the invoice. As we click on the block, fields will be highlighted in the invoice. For this process we are capturing, vendor name, invoice number, invoice date, invoice amount, place of supply, base amount, CGST, SGST and integrated GST. Similarly details have been captured for other invoices also, let's quickly look few more documents. All the invoices are of different vendors. In this process we have tried to cater multiple formats, making sure that all the required fields present on the invoices are captured. As we see, all the details have been captured successfully from the invoices. OCR will automatically export the process batch into an Excel sheet. Excel sheet will have all the details which were captured from an invoices. Bot can then use this Excel sheet as an input to verify the information entered during the invoice booking in the vendor ledger. It will then launch the SAP application. It will then enter valid user credentials to log in. Bot will then enter the valid T code to open appropriate screen from where vendor ledger report will be downloaded. It will enter the details in the required parameters which needs to be filled for downloading the report. It will enter the valid file name. Bot has completed the downloading part. Duplicate Invoice Bot will check all the entries in Ledger and will mark the entries as an absolute or potential duplicate in an output report. Bot has now stopped. Let's look over the output report which has been generated. Duplicate entries are identified based on three conditions. In condition 1, if two or more entries have same values in following four columns, vendor code column, invoice number column, invoice date and invoice amount column. They are marked as absolute duplicate. For the first two entries marked as absolute duplicate based on condition 1, have same vendor code, 102341, same invoice number INV2178, same invoice date 13, June, 2016 and same invoice amount 21780. In the similar way, in condition 2, if two or more entries have same values in following column, Vendor code column, invoice date column and invoice amount column. They are marked as potential duplicate. As you can see, 
highlighted entries marked as potential duplicate and conditioned to have the same vendor code for 00025, same invoice date, 24, July, 2018 and same invoice amount 3320. In condition 3, entries are marked as potential duplicate if they have same values in vendor code column and invoice number column. For accurate results, we remove the special characters from the invoice number column before we run the duplicate check on vendor ledger and same can be seen for the vendor code, INV2178. In same way we can check and mark other entries also if needed. This brings us to the end of the demo, thank you for your time.